13 May 1969 is a major date in Malaysian history. No one denies it, but no one really harps about it either. I spent some time with two individuals finding out about the significance the date has for them. Warung Saga is a popular restaurant in Johor Bahru. The name was given by owner Ismail Muhammad Safri because he started serving people in 1986, the same time our national car was launched. Makan ini jadi makanan masak jo. Di hari satu lasi jo, hari ahad mie rebus, hari senin mie sangkuah, hari sasa lasi nyonya, hari rabu mie sup sambal belacan, hari kamis soto. Nasi lemak, lontong, kupi, agak-agak dia. Haji Mak kita tutup. Aside from food, Saga is famous for its historical pictures plastered all over the walls of which Ismail has spent a good 30 years of his life collecting. Dengan gambar-gambar lama, angka simpan, gambar Sultan Johor, gambar Tiwakson, gambar Agung, gala-gala, film-film tak. Being in his 50s, Ismail has 13 May still on his mind. Liu Sing Tat is much younger than Ismail. This award-winning filmmaker isn't even 30 yet. When I met him, he insisted that I only shoot footage of his tortoise for some reason. I make mostly feature films. Um, my next project is about a Chinese Malaysian who goes to the desert uh, to look for love, but he finds only camels and uh, more camels. That's, it's a romantic comedy. Uh, the working title is I Miss You Like the Desert Miss the Rain. <laughs> <laughs> it's a romantic comedy, I told you. It's a Malaysian film, so you expect uh, what, Malay, English, Chinese, maybe not Tamil, no. Why not? A... It would be strange for Malaysian Chinese to speak Tamil in the desert. Seng Tan wasn't even alive when 13 May happened. I mean, if you open the door for the Malays back then, you get probably chopped into pieces and they will cook rendang <laughs> with your meat. And it's vice versa, I think. If the Malays open the door for Chinese, they will, you know, Chinese will chop you into pieces and uh, they cook bakute. Both feel that they have their own particular role to play in the development of Malaysia. Kita niaga ni, kita berat customer tu kaum kita. Kawan mesra, itu yang kita jadi macam ni. Harga lebih kurang, jangan melampau sangat. Kalau orang India nak makan mie rebo, kita tak bagi, ada daging. Semua tu kita termasuk lah ni. Nak terang dengan dia yang cari ikhlas. Semua kaum boleh campur, boleh duduk ke meja, boleh berbuat, boleh apa. Kita jangan mengata-ngata. Ha, jangan sentuh pasal agama, pasal bangsa yang kita sentuh. Kita buat macam kawan, kita Malaysia. I think a, a, a Malaysian like me will always um, tell my stories as... For me, I will tell my story, I will always tell my stories as a Malaysian. What define you as a Malaysian? It's all these things, all these ingredients. Uh, you're Malaysian Chinese, you have uh, friends of different races. Uh, oh, all these elements make, make you a complete Malaysian. So, yes, if, I, if I'm a Malaysian filmmaker, I want to make a Malaysian film, all this will be in there, naturally. Okay, so you've seen a restaurant owner and you've seen a filmmaker. And you've seen and heard what they have to say about May 13 and how it affects them and their work. So there you go. Zan Azli for the Malaysian Insider.